Yo guys, what up? I'm bringing you my first pack opening of Madden 25. Uh, I splurged a little bit. Not, not really splurged, but uh, I bought a 15 Pro pack on the first day the game came out. Uh, I don't know why, because there was nothing really in packs. I was just, I was looking at the forums. Everybody was pulling packs. People were pulling like elite APs and Calvin Johnsons and all that. So I decided I'd give it a shot. Um, so these are the cards that I get. Nothing, nothing spectacular. I think I pulled an elite center in one of them towards the end. And then you, you also get toppers when you buy, I think you need to buy at least a 15 pro pack and then you get a topper elite. So you're at least guaranteed one elite. Uh, my elite ends up being like a fullback. So, I mean, it wasn't really a needed card. But anyway, I had uh, just want to talk about the game so far. Right now, I'm, uh, I haven't really been playing that much, to be honest. I know the game's only been out like three days, but I don't know. It just it hasn't been entertaining. Like they have the new collection, but it only gives you six k. And I looked the cards up on the auction block yesterday, and they were each like ten to fifteen k. And I don't like unless you pull packs with MSP, you can't really do it because I. Not many people have, like, enough money to go buy out every card on the auction block. Uh, right now, I have 20k, and uh, I was wondering how you guys are making coins. I heard people are pulling packs and then just selling everything in the pack. Uh, and also, uh, are you guys, like, sniping cards? What's your best snipe? Because, I mean, I sniped a few collectibles yesterday, but they took a while to sell. Like, I don't know what was going on. Maybe because there were a bunch on the auction house, so maybe I just couldn't see them all. I'm not really sure, but I, from what I could see, I, I priced mine like at least 6k below everybody else's. So uh, anyway, uh, yeah, so the new collection came out. I'm not going to make a video on it because it wasn't anything special. It was just uh, the all 25 team collection, so you get... All the 25 players, legendary collectibles, you can't put them on your team, from what I know, because you can't even flip the card. There are no stats on them. And uh, and then once you complete the collection, you get 6K, and then you can do a solo challenge that gives you a 98 overall Barry Sanders. So, in my opinion, the collection isn't really worth doing, unless you're going to spend tons of MSP on the game it's not really going to be completable at least for a little while until the prices on the cards drop and uh, I was just wondering how you guys are liking the game so far a lot of people have already like given up on it I've been looking at the forums and people are saying like it's it's impossible to play not just ultimate team but the game itself like with defense you put man on and your defensive backs can't even catch up to the wide receivers and things like that and then in ultimate team how like pro packs are 7500 so imagine how much when they release a legendary pack or whatever it's going to be imagine how much that's going to be so people have just been complaining a lot uh the chemistry also doesn't seem to be working uh people are saying like they they're getting beat by starter pack teams when they are just going for chemistry they want to get their chemistry as high as possible but they're saying that even when you have the highest chemistry possible, you still get beat by like 75 overalls or something. So, I mean, how are you guys liking it? Right now, for me, I haven't really been playing, as I said. I'll keep bringing videos, but right now, as of now, I don't have any cards to give away. So, giveaways are going to have to wait. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, uh, I'll see you guys later.